Okay, I'm gonna film now. Team quiet right now. Hey guys, it's Ritz Rose 2. I got some Mac goodies, so this will be Mac Attack Foe. Foe. Foe? Foe. I think I've done three. So I went to this uh, pro makeup course technique class type thing. They have them at the pro stores. They're really cool. It teaches you technique by technique. You're never too old to learn. You know what I mean? I went and got some things and I wanted to share them with you, okay? Before we get into it, I posted this look on Instagram. You know, I said easy does it because I am wearing an easy ease shirt. Most people ask about this lip. Some people guess it was Rebel Diva Wet n Wild color, but it is not. It is a Jordana lip liner in Cabernet. Cabernet. And then Revlon. I've been loving Revlon. Revlon. I think I have like six tubes of colors. This one is called Violet Frenzy, and it looks like this. It's very pink, but this one just totally makes it makes it dark. So. God, I look oily or sweaty. This light is not doing it for me. So the first thing that grabbed my attention was um, this. This I got a Glamour Day as a part of the holiday set here. It looks really cute. And they're pigments. What is this? Pigments. The only reason why I bought it is because of the two. There's four in here. It comes up to $32.50 or something like that. But this one looks like club. It's called uh, I've Got a Crush on You. Do you? And it looks like that. We love pigments, right? Pigments are great because they can go on anywhere. I mean, like on the eye, you can make them, you know, put them on your lips or something like that. Um, let, I don't have a mirror here. Um, it, it, I am so unprepared for this haul. And there's another green in here. I have uh, this green glitter that looks just like this. It's This one's called Spruced, but I mean, it looks fabulous, darling. And especially if you're wearing a lot of berries and wine color lips, I'm telling you, green, especially like an emerald green like this, looks good, girl, because they're complementary colors, and this has a little bit of shine. You can even do it just like as an eyeliner. I mean, you know what to do, right? And of course, there's like a white one uh, if you want to get like Chola eyeliner on top of the black, you know what I'm saying? And then this one looks like a silvery, greenish one. Anyway, these are fantastic. There's other colors in there that uh, they have, and they come in a pack of four. You can't choose. You have to pick the four that they come in, but this was really cool like this and as far as foundations because you know I've been switching them up uh, usually I use this I use been using the Stila wear all day stay all day play all day I don't know I use the studio fix fluid is really good but this one is a studio sculpt I am an NC 42 and I'm really excited to ch uh, ch chase this one try this one because um, they used it in demonstration so um, Let's see what this one has to say. Um, I think the Studio Fix Fluid, sometimes, I guess if I'm going out at night and I want a heavier wear, I'll wear that one. And you're hearing Boo run around like crazy. Uh, there's tile in this house. I just moved, so that's why it looks kind of bare. Also bought a eyeshadow from this Glamour Days. It's super pretty. It's called Stylish Mary and it's a mineral light extra dimension thing um, and it comes like it looks like it's like baked type I think and it's really pretty because I've been wearing a lot of berry colors so I figured like maybe I'll put one of these on my eyes. Mis Ojos. It kind of looks like stars and rockets but without so much of that bluish purpley um, finish, that pearl finish. Then of course I had my back to Mac. If you have any containers from Mac, save six empty ones and then you can turn them in and get a free eyeshadow, lipstick, or lip glass. So that's what I did. You can never have enough mystery eyeshadow. I think um, mine broke in half. And this is just great for a crease color. It's called mystery, it's a satin finish. And it's a brown, like a topiish brown, if you will. But this is a must-have color. 
eyeshadow from MAC for your natural looks. And then I went and got three lipsticks because I am a lipstick girl. Ah, mirala, mirala. I got shy girl, hey, hey, look at that, I got shy girl. I saw it, I didn't even, I saw the color and I was like, oh, okay, but then I saw the title um, or the name of the lipstick, I'm like, do you got sad girl too? You got sad girl? This is super beautiful. It, um, it's a nudie, peachy color and it's a cream sheen, so it's got a nice finish and a lot of emollients for your lips. Um, and it's it's pretty. This one is so dope. It's called Violetta, and it is an amplified, which is not quite matte, but the same pigmentation, just a little bit more creamy, but not as creamy as a cream sheen. Did that did that make? Sense? Look at this. <gasps> at the end of this video, I'm gonna actually just put it on and show you, but not right now, but I just wanna pull out everything and show you and then set up shop for, I was really unprepared for this video, apparently. But Violetta, awesome, awesome, awesome color, oof. I wanna take a bath in And then last but not least, I can't find my, one of my favorite lipsticks from MAC. And a lot of you thought that I was wearing the color now, but it, it's not so. This is Diva. Diva has always been one of my favorite colors. And I saw a lot of videos out this fall. They're like, oh, fall, so your lipsticks, this is Diva. I have loved Diva for years and years to come. Uh, or I have loved this for years and years before, not to come. I will love it for years to come. But um, this is a matte red Merlot E. It's almost like a brick red. I don't brown red ish color, but it's a, it's so pretty and just like bam in your face. So um, this is Diva. I had to get another one, and they were all free. But anyway, I'm gonna uh, show you what everything looks like. I'm gonna play with this makeup in front of you. But those are the things that I got today. And uh, for those of you that don't really want to watch me play with makeup and are over the video already, blah. Hi, I'm back. <laughs> so the first color that I'm gonna play with is this, I've got a crush on you, I think. I've got a crush on you, and I told you it had that very cool, uh, shimmering, finishing, uh, pigment-y thing, which goes really cool with wine-colored lips and purples. Oh, wow. Yes, this looks just like Club. I like that one, do you? It's nice and soft. It's not too intense, but I'm sure if I wet this, I could put it on a little bit um, more heavy. And then this mystery, I'm gonna show you guys why you probably should have this color just for your everyday use. Just kind of pop it right in the outer V there. And just to deepen it up. Doesn't matter what color you put on your eyelid. So, you got something like that. Oh, look at that. You see that? Fire. And you see what I mean by saying that the greens? Oh, that looks so good together. Green, um, and this actually has like almost like a purpley brown color um, when it's not in the light right here and over here, but it's got that green, it's almost like a snake. And it even goes with this. Look at that, I got two looks in one. Two, like wrist rose two. C42 stuff. It doesn't feel greasy. It feels more moisturizing. Oh wow. Does it look nice? See it? I don't know, but those lips look nice. Whoo! Anyway, all of it will be down below. Thank you so much for watching. Thumbs up.
I love you guys. Mwah. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.